architecture is both unspectacular and brilliant. David Chipperfield is being honoured with two awards for his design for Berlin's Neues Museum. Arts 21 presents the Master of Simplicity. David Chipperfield spent a decade on what was one of Germany's most hotly debated construction projects, the Neues Museum in Berlin. 70% of the building was destroyed in World War II. The Neues Museum is part of the German capital's Museum Island, recognized as a UNESCO World Heritage Site. So conservationists, city planners, historians and architecture critics all wanted to have a say in how it was renovated. For Chipperfield, it was a huge responsibility, but one he says he thoroughly enjoyed. For me, um, without doubt, this has been the most extraordinary experience and most fantastic uh, project to work on. I will never have such uh, an intense experience again, I think. Chipperfield's Neues Museum reveals the beauty of the incomplete, the vulnerability of architecture, and the scars of history. His courage to leave open these wounds, ones many didn't want to see, made him the target of personal attacks. The enormity of the staircase comes as a shock, yet it retains the proportions of the original one which was destroyed. The design was the subject of much discussion, but David Chipperfield found this to be inspiring rather than insulting. We spend our life complaining that no one is interested in architecture. In, this, in Berlin, everyone is interested in this project, so I can't complain. I mean, I think it's much better that people are interested, even to be critical. I mean, that's, for me, that's not a problem. David Chipperfield is the most diplomatic of the great architects, one who's cool enough to even question himself. And the Germans often call upon the British architect's services. Chipperfield also designed the new building for the Museum of Modern Literature in Marbach. The shaded entrance helps to filter out the light because the literary treasures housed inside need to be protected from the sun. There's a sort of double desire in designing a museum. One is to make it you know, easy to find your way in, easy to find your way around, but at the same time, possible that you can lose yourself <clears throat> and that it becomes a sort of a world in itself. Whether it's Anchorage, Alaska, Hangzhou, China, or Barcelona, Spain, Chipperfield is in demand around the globe, even if his buildings don't appear to be that spectacular. Yet developing an unmistakable Chipperfield style is something that's never interested him. For the architect, it's all about connecting with the surroundings. I'm used to trying to understand and enjoying what it means to be in one place or another. I'm not an architect that likes to land an architecture, which is my architecture. I like to somehow see, understand what, what this project could be. David Chipperfield's latest museum project in Germany opened in January. The Museum Volkwang in Essen houses classic modern art. The building is bright and transparent. Chipperfield has managed to create a functional yet elegant structure, which locals have dubbed the wonder of Essen. The architecture is not meant to be the first thing. The architecture is a tool. It's just meant to be something which holds you then, of course, you can notice that it's been well considered, but I don't really want people to come here and say, oh, wow, oh, wow. I mean, I mean actually, what they're coming is for the, for the paintings. I want them to walk straight to the work. It's the restrained quality of David Chipperfield's architecture that gives the artworks room to breathe. It doesn't overwhelm them, or the old museum dating from the 1960s, to which the new building is connected. There was a danger that the new building would humiliate and leave the old building as a, as a forgotten piece. And instead, we really wanted to embrace it and, and borrow uh, its qualities. David Chipperfield always manages to capture the spirit of the place, 
and make museums inviting. And people come in droves. Berlin's Neues Museum has welcomed more than half a million visitors since it reopened in the fall of 2009. And for Chipperfield, this is what really makes a building complete. I don't believe architecture looks better empty. I think architecture looks better with people and for the things it's meant, meant to do. It's this approach that won David Chipperfield the Große Nike, or Great Nike Architecture Award and the Europa Nostra Award for his reconstruction of the Neues Museum. In 2012, Chipperfield will make the revival of Berlin's Museum Island complete with the opening of the James Simon Gallery. Visitors will be able to access all of the island's five museums through this new entrance building.